Hey everybody, Fox Rose here. So, um, I wanted to talk about some things that have happened since the net neutrality thing and, uh, what's been going on in my life. And I know that I haven't uploaded anything since that video. And, um, I know that we've been getting subscribers on the channel and I just wanted to say thank you so much for the people who have joined recently. Um, I know I haven't uploaded anything since you joined, but that's because I'm working on stuff in the background, and I'm kind of changing the direction of the channel very slightly, very slightly, but that's just because of the fact that I realize now that YouTube is kind of screwing smaller channels over, so a lot of stuff has changed to kind of remind myself what I did YouTube for in the first place. I did it for a place to have fun, to enjoy myself, and the payment wall thing is kind of screwing my channel over because of the fact that I'm letting it kind of manipulate what I put on YouTube. So, I just want to say that's not what my channel is about anymore. I've had some eye-opening moments in the past few weeks, and I just wanted to say Thank you so much for the people who still watch my content. You are amazing, and I love you for it. Um, that's one thing. Another thing is that I recently, <laughs> very recently, as of the time I'm recording this, was in a car accident. So, to give basic ideas and a general consensus of what happened, um, let me explain. Since about late October of last year, 2017, I have been working at a new job, and it's been a re really wonderful time. I love my job now. The people I work with are amazing. The job itself isn't bad. I wish the pay was a tiny bit higher. Not much. Maybe like five, ten cents. But otherwise, I, I love my job to pieces. No complaints. But, um... I was on my way to work just a few days ago, and I hit a sharp corner, going towards the right, and uh, the whole road was black ice. So, I completely lost control of my vehicle as I was making the corner, um, I slipped into the other lane, I was slamming the brakes to the best of my ability, but they weren't working because black ice... And I hit an oncoming vehicle. Um, everyone was okay in the situation. Um, once the fire department and police were on the scene, they were all slipping and sliding on their feet as well. Um, there was about a quarter inch of black ice on the road, so nobody was at fault for the accident. Other than the town who is in charge of that road. So, yeah. Um, as I'm recording this, I'm actually on a bit of pain meds right now, because this event only occurred just a few days ago. Um, nothing serious happened to either party involved, thank God, but I just wanted to get this out to you guys to inform you on that one. Um, other things that have been happening in the background, I've been, this, this part of the video is a lot more laid back and chilled, because... That's the only truly negative thing that has occurred since I uploaded the net neutrality thing. Um, the more positive stuff, let's see. Um, I've gotten some more Beyblades recently that I'm actually going to be redoing some older videos to actually demonstrate some stuff. Because I've actually got corrected versions of collection stuff. I've gotten more stuff for Beyblade Burst, I've gotten a lot better equipment, actually. And I just wanted to point that out. So that's one thing that'll be coming out in the future. Um, another thing is that I've gotten the new Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth Hacker's Memory. I beat the game, and without spoilers, because I know people care about that sort of thing from me, since I haven't even finished Cyber Sleuth 1 on the channel, um... To give a basic plot summary, 
you play as a different main character with some characters that were a part of Arata's old group, Jude. It's not that big of a plot point, so don't think it's that important. But it does influence how some characters act and react to certain situations and such. Um, some crazy shit happens, and I can't say much other than that, because like Cyber Sleuth 1, it is very plot heavy. Speaking of Cyber Sleuth, I've been working very hard on the videos for that whenever I'm not working on stuff for the channel. Um, episode, well, chapter 16 is going to be an entirety of one whole episode, and... I'll basically sound like a shit monk because the whole recording itself was close to four and a half hours. So I sped the footage up to four times the speed. So you'll have very little chance to actually understand what the hell I'm saying. Unless you want to watch the video at a quarter speed. So that way you can actually gauge what's going on. Um, That's just one important thing. Another important thing is the fact that once Cyber Sleuth 1 is over, Hacker's Memory will be taking over its place. And I've, like I said, beaten the game. Um, I was actually really fortunate because I got Alphamon or Yukin, one of the new Digimon forms in the game, before the Ryudamon update happened. That added the whole Ryudamon Digivolution line, which would be Ryuda, Ginryu, Hisharyu, and Oryumon, respectively. The last two, I don't know how to say their names. That's why I pronounced them the way I did. But um, they were a part of a DNA digivolution with Alphamon to create Alphamon or Yukin, which is ironically the mode that we see in uh, the original Cyber Sleuth, but not really because you no know, the DNA digivolution for that and yada yada yada. Um, that's just some fun stuff that's going to be going on in the background. Um, the reason this video is all in kind of the dark, so to speak, is because of the fact that I don't want to tell you, uh, show you anything going on in the background or with the channel or anything like that just yet, because, um, things have been going hectic, obviously, like I stated earlier in the video, and, um, I've kind of just been recovering. We've already taken the proper measures for all that stuff, so don't worry about me in that respect. Everything is fine in the background, so no sweat there. Uh, content will slowly be coming out as time goes on. Um, there will be some changes, minor changes, to the channel's um, outward appearance. Like, uh, I have a friend who is also an artist who is going to be kind of doing a overhaul for some of the artwork on the channel, uh, such as the channel icon, um, the banner, which I'm sorry, uh, the WBBA or torn pages, whatever you're being called right now, haven't really checked out your videos in a long time. Sorry, buddy. Um, whoever you're calling yourself now, um, they'll be doing the new banner, which I loved what he did, just, it doesn't really scream me, it just screams, oh, these are characters that I like a lot, that's it. So, that will be changing as well, um, AMVs will be a thing that's coming back to the channel at some point, yeah, no joke. Um... It won't be anything like the newest Beyblade Burst God episode or anything like that. Just some stuff will be coming out when I get to it. And if an idea just strikes me. Other stuff that I gotta talk about is the fact that... Um... Countdown videos will be becoming a thing on the channel. And... Thanks to Black Mage Maverick, whose link will be in the description... Um, he actually gave me some ideas, not directly, but from watching his video with, um, Silver Keyblade, the top 10 Sonic boss fights video. He gave me some ideas for the channel, and the same artist who's going to be helping out with the banner and the icon 
is actually going to be doing some poses, kind of like in that video, but I haven't figured out any yet, so if you guys could think of anything that you think would be kind of cool to see in a countdown video for the Fox character for the channel, please let me know in the comments below. Um, I know this video is going on for quite a bit of time, but I just wanted to let you all know about that. Uh, lastly, the big fun thing that I gotta mention is Xenoblade Chronicles 2. I'm going to be perfectly honest, it's easily in my top five favorite games of last year. Easily. And that's the same year that we got the frickin', uh... Kingdom Hearts HD 2.8 Final Chapter Prologue with the new thing for Aqua in the 0 0.2 Birth by Sleep thing. But yeah, that's all the important stuff that I gotta tell you guys about right now. Um, Kingdom Hearts 3 should be coming out sometime this year, and you bet your sweet ass I'm gonna be jumping on that shit. Um, I have a list already written out for the top 10 games of last year, just working on the script right now, and once the artwork stuff is done, you guys will be seeing that video. But I just wanted to get this update sort of video slash audio recording thing out for you guys. So there's that. Last but not least, thank you all so much for watching my content for all this time. I know that I'm not consistent with uploading, and that will definitely be a thing in the future. Um, consistent upload schedules will not be a thing until things have died down and we actually get some stuff all set for the channel. I just wanted to say that now, and thank you all for sticking with the channel for so long and helping the channel grow and just being there for me. I greatly appreciate it. I don't want to do the outro spiel because I've kind of given up on the outro stuff. So thank you all so much for watching and I hope you all have a fantastic day and I will see you next time with the, well, I don't know what it'll be, but I'll see you guys next time. Bye.